The fund's strong performance the last five years is in a large part due to a very high and strong focus on valuation. Going back to last year's uh, results, the only year with negative performance, I would highlight not owning Apple in the second half uh, as one of the reasons why we were slightly behind the index. This year we have gained by not owning Apple, once again showing that discipline in the investment process is important. I would also like to highlight uh, as we go into the second half that currently our largest position is Samsung, which is a very uh, unpopular uh, stock at this point in time. Samsung has been a strong share gainer for 10 years in mobile phones, televisions and memory. This company is currently trading at six times earnings and we feel earnings is estimated fair. Results so far this year has been strong. We're up 8% more than the index and total performance for the fund is 18%. All the strong performance than not owning Apple has been being long Activision, being long Ubisoft, Renewable Energy Corporation and Dell. As we enter the second half of 2013, the risk premium in the market is still high. The average of TMT stocks is uh, trading at 13 times earnings, which is very attractive given the interest rate at this point in time. Looking on how the market looks upon the universe, it is clear to us that people anticipate smartphone earnings to half. Both Apple and Samsung is trading almost at six times earnings ex cash. When we look on the best opportunities for the second half, these two stocks is among them. But we would also highlight that, that there will be a very interesting second half for products going into the living room. Both Microsoft with the new Xbox and Sony with the, the new PlayStation is having a launch. In addition, we ex expect Apple and Google to launch gaming machines going into the living room. We have positioned us for these events by buying into some of the gaming companies, more specifically Gameloft and Ubisoft.